please like this video and subscribe because my videos will prepare you for the inevitable zombie apocalypse. In the event that the whole world goes to crap and we all turn to zombies, grab a sharp metal object, strap a blowtorch to it, and swing like mad. It's as simple as that, ladies and gentlemen. See? I just saved your life. The least you can do is like and subscribe. So you buy a fancy new SSD or a hard drive, you plug the power cable and SATA cable into the drive, you plug the SATA cable into your motherboard, then you power up your computer and you can't wait to start using your new hard drive. And then you realize your new drive or drives aren't there. Where'd they go? Don't panic. Nine times out of ten, your hard drive is not defective nor is it dead. You just need to initialize or format your drive. To do that, go to the start menu and type in disk management and go to create and format hard disk partitions. Click on that, I'll make it a little bit bigger. Now some of you might get this initialize disk prompt where it says do you want to do MBR or do you want to do GPT? MBR is an older version, you'd only use that if you had something like Windows XP, but if you have Windows 7, 8, or 10, use GPT. So click that and click OK. Your new hard drive or hard drives are going to have a black line over them, and they're also going to be labeled unallocated. Right click the drive and go to new simple volume. Click next. Don't change anything on the screen. Click next. Then here you're going to choose the letter that you want to assign the drive. So I'm going to choose B because mine is going to be boot up drive. So you can choose whatever letter you want to though. Then click next. On here don't change anything except down here where it's volume label. You can change that to whatever name you want. Uh, I'm going to put mine as boot drive. You can put it as games, you can put storage, you can put whatever name you want to. Then click next and then press finish. It'll take a few seconds and boom, the hard drive is formatted and it's ready to go. If you have any other hard drives or SSDs, do the exact same thing. Just right click, new simple volume, next, next. Choose the letter. I'm going to do S for this guy because it's going to be my storage drive. Next, and I'll just label it storage. Next, finish. And bam, it's all done. It's ready to load games, programs, anything. And that pretty much sums it up. Hope you guys liked the video. It was helpful. Please subscribe. And click anywhere on the screen to see a ridiculously goofy rap battle between AMD and NVIDIA. Click here to see how PC graphics in the 1990s evolved and influenced the games we play today.